just a little bit as it sits. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the truck off. Just a little bit. I just saw some stuff. Let's go around. What's this stuff? Wait a minute. We see more stuff. What is this stuff? It looks like motors. Hold on. We see stuff and stuff. We see more stuff. What we got here? Yeah, we take that. Definitely. Saw some lamps over here. We'll scoop those up here on the right. Hitting the old flashes. We'll block a little bit of driveway. It's alright, we won't be long. for a blue palette. We'll take it. Why's y'all blurry looking? Everybody's blurry. Alright, Alright, so we got a tie-dye machine. Clean and easy, huh? It's a tie-dye machine. And we got some tie-dye colors in there, rubber bands, little squirt bottles. Insert shirt and twist, squirt dye in the tube. Give them the thumbs up. Not even open. <laughs> this bad boy, $29.99. Brand newbie. 120 yards of super soft Shanlin yard. Yarn, my first weaving loom. Look at that. Look how happy she is. 30 bucks for this, and then they threw it out. I mean, I don't know. I've kind of been there, too. You know, buy something and never use it. I don't think I ever threw it out, though. The alarm is uh, going on right now, so, well, I don't know what if it's an alarm or what, but here's front rooms full of a bunch of cubicles and chairs. We, I don't know, depending on how much time I could spend in here, I might take the steel off of these things. Here's the rest of the cabinets, man, there's a bunch. Look at all these chairs. Right here, it's crazy. Crazy, right? There's a stack of them, look at that. These things, the whole stack. It's crazy, here's more chairs. Crazy, right? More cubicles. Got a bunch of these, little LED lights. A bunch of them already. More chairs in the bathroom, everybody. More chairs in the bathroom. All right, we got them all set up because we're gonna go through all the drawers, you know, because there's stuff in there. Keys, wires, paper clip staplers. Wow, there's that, it's all cleared out. Crazy, huh?
Yuck, man. Had to bust a Yui. We're gonna get that mug. Right there. It's a freebie. Well, we stopped by the no-go dumpy. We got ourselves an orange shirt. We can use that for flaggage. We got ourselves some wire and some nice cap pipe. Add to the collection. We got this bad boy. Piece of junk. Black and Decker. Zip, 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 zip. In the trash. Cool. Some greasy wire. I'm not even going to touch it without my gloves. But this black, green, and red wire here is all greasy, greasy. So, today... We're here to fill up on some more mat oak. We gotta get this towed into the storage unit. It's just full of miscellaneous stuff. A lot of it came out of the uh, those filing cabinets, like rubber bands, post notes, pins. Uh, got the keys in there and a bunch of little screws. We're gonna turn in uh, 39 pounds of Bear Bright, and then we're gonna throw up some more steel we're gonna drop off the steel and then the bear bright today some nice little pieces then we're gonna come back to the unit and start cutting away at some copper and aluminum and some brass what's this thing over here somebody left this i don't know if i should take that or if that's for the taking little roll around thing huh. yeah. they rusted rusty boys right in see over here yes we did see it we saw it I really don't have any more shreddables but that's a start of a good pile maybe we can get that dude apart you know usually I'm so busy I can't take him apart to see what kind of coin we got in there <laughs> it's actually a washer not too many coins are up in those all right, we got some old sheet, old sheet, dirty brass, copper two, copper two, clean brass, clean brass. Let's get in there. Clean brass, some breakage, aluminum breakage. Kind of mixed in with my extrusions. We got those. And we got that bad boy right there filled with junk wire. Let's look at it. Man, I gotta go. We're always pressed for time. Junky junk. I'm always pressed for time. My day off, I'm pressed for time. Ain't that? Get on down, get on down. This guy, oh, he's about to lose a ceiling fan. Holy shit, ski. 1222, this is a bad time to come to the scrapyard on the non fair side. I'm like the ninth person in line. Ah! Does it got a little. No, that's all wood. No, that's. That's some kind of metal. That's aluminum. So we picked up some metal racks and a little bit of metals from Mama McKee's store.
Hello, pallets. Stainless steel. Couplings. Little bit of sits. Those are pocket sits. Yeah, I got my bucket. Big hoses. Let's just see what we got down there real quick. Heat got my phone shutting off. Oh yeah, we got some stuff in here. We got some stuff. All right, we're gonna dig in. We're gonna dig in. Let me get my buckets and my wire cutters, JD minis. Mm. I don't know how well that's gonna hold, but yeah. Get out of here. We got a few more places to hit. Let's do it. What you got? What you holy cow, we got it. Mm-hmm. More pallets too. All right. Holy cheat. I don't know where the the rad was for this thing, but you know. <laughs> Who cares? Dudes. Dudes. And dudettes. I mean, I'm about to start yanking this stuff out. This is crazy. There's some, there's some BX cable this size that has wires in it in here. A lot of this BX cable has wires in it. I felt it. it felt, you know, you can feel it. It's heavier. It's heavy. Man, we got cat wire. We got number one and number two wire. That's gonna be bright wire. As soon as I get done with it, I'm gonna strip this. It looks like I'm gonna have to fix the machine, man. My cut, my cut wheel on the stripper keeps kicking off to the side. I'm guess I'm gonna have to keep fixing it because we're gonna be stripping for miles, man. Miles. We'll turn 15 cents to the 20 cents a pound into. I think it was 57 cents a pound for old sheet. That's what they'll give me for it. We try not to get all the trash, but there's gonna be trash in there. Woo! The, this sealed unit's gonna have to go to the far yard, so we'll have to get a, a load ready for that so we can dump that out there. I'm not gonna get paid so quick. Uh, you know, this, this strip and all this wire is gonna take a long time. I mean, I was throwing wires, gobs of wires up into the bed, aluminum. Oh, all right. 
There's our steely shred. A little bit of a mix that we're going to clean, of course, of course. Big trash can full of wire. Some number one, mostly number two. But we're going to strip it to make it bright copper. Bare bright. There are some steely shreds and some keep life and some pallets and some old sheet. Uh, there's more old sheet just going through. That's the empty casing. There's more old sheet. Right there is big old wires. Stripped, already stripped, of course. Junk wire, communication wire. Unfortunately, I only get low grade for it, but it's like 74 cents a pound, 84 cents a pound, whatever. A dollar something would be better. Uh, here's the BX cable that has wire in it. Like that. Look at that. Or that. Couldn't wait till the day I found one of these. Had wire in it. <laughs> Show sure enough. We got wires in it. Ugh. There's some old sheet. This is all aluminum wire. Super thick. There's some steely shreds. There's my stinky shoes. I ruined my shoes and my good pants. Uh, dumper diving. <laughs> but I think it was well worth it. I think we're going to buy some, I mean, you know, they came from uh, Goodwill, so. I think we'll make another trip to Goodwill. <laughs> All right, we're, we're still working on this. Uh, this was stuff I totally couldn't leave in my uh, truck at the apartment complex, so I had to come out here to the far unit that is packed full of scraps and sellables and uh, scraps, mostly in pallets. <laughs> and I got the big unit is also full of uh, scraps so I keep saying I'm not going to dive until this is all taken care of but man when you get that itching when you get that itching when you got that feeling see I wasn't even going to go there I wasn't even going to go to the no go dumpy too and sure enough I'm glad I did I jumped. I saw that. You saw it. I, I got film of it. I rarely film that place. And I was in that dumpy for about an hour and a half shifting. A bunch of trash. And there was probably a bunch more in there I missed. But I thought an hour and a half was long enough. <laughs> All right, let's get it on. Sit, meow, mix, sit. Meow. That's a good pussy. You know, Dan Gobbick. Yeah, he cool. Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you know him? 